idea. Bubba got an idea. <laughs> that means there's still a chance for a miracle. Yeah. My brother's back used to lock up on him like this. You just gotta know what to do. Hey, Bubba, I don't think we should fool around with Pop's back. Maybe we should call a doctor. Oh, it's so easy. See, all you gotta do is stand behind him and then fold his arms like this here. Be careful. And then give him an adjustment. Watch. Bubba, Bubba. I'm warning you. Have you hurt me? I'm gonna sue you for malpractice of the brain. <laughs> now! Ah! <laughs> oh, Bubba! <laughs> Damn! And presto! Just <laughs> yeah. give me strength. Give me strength. I'll presto your head. <laughs> so I do not know what hit you. What's the matter? Didn't the pain go away? Yeah, for about two seconds, as I was unconscious. <laughs> but I'm gonna knock you out. Wait, 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 wait a minute, Wait a minute, now. Hey, how's your back feeling, Pop? A little bit better, son. You made the soup? Yeah, I got it right here. Is it nice and hot? Yeah. Take Give it in. Take it easy. <laughs> yeah. Ah, oh, that's good, son. Hey, you know, Pop, you never did tell me how you hurt your back in the first place. I know I never told you, son, but I think you're old enough to know now. You see, when I was a young man in St. Louis, I was quite the ladies' man. In fact, they used to call me Rudolph Vaselino. I think that's Valentino. Yeah, him too. Well, Anyway, one Saturday night, I took this girl, uh, Rosalind uh, Wilson, to the movies. It was dark and romantic, and after a while, I made my move. Then she made her move. Then I made my move. Then she made her move. Then I made my last big move. And that's how you hurt your back, making your last big move? No, I hurt my back when she made her last big move and threw me out the balcony. 